Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Let's react to Marcos Alonso. He will be leaving Barcelona as a free agent at the end of the season, according to Fabrizio Romano, just after two seasons that Barca bought him. I will be giving my voice and I want you guys to make sure you smash the like, new to the channel, please make sure you subscribe for more Barca news. Sharing the screen right now, as you can see in here, Marcos Alonso will leave Barcelona as a free agent at the end of the season. That was confirmed by Fabrizio Romano. And um, I will give my thoughts, which I'm going to be honest with you guys. Yeah, I am happy because I've never been a, a fan of Marcos Alonso. I think he did well at Chelsea. And um, at Barca, yeah, I'm not going to lie. He had his moments, mainly in the first season. That, you know, Barca won the league, but we all know why Barca signed Marcos Alonso. Yeah, he had a pay, pay cut on his wages when he signed for Barca, but, well, we signed him as a free agent too, so... And um, we did sign him. We all know why we signed him. We signed him because Barcelona financial problems. This was the reason we signed him, because I'm pretty sure we would have never gone for Marcos Alonso. He is like, what, I think 33 years old now? I mean, I don't know where he will be going next. Maybe Saudi Arabia, maybe no, who knows? But I'm, I, I, I can't lie to you guys. I can't just lie to you guys and, you know, telling you guys that oh, I am sad that he's leaving. I wish if he stayed because I'm lying to myself. And you shouldn't be doing that. I'm always honest. You guys know. That's why Ferreira only speaks facts. So, um, yeah, I'm quite glad. I think it's time to clean the house. I think it's time to clean this kind of players. But, yeah, I mean, all depends what is going to happen with Barca. Um, financial situation is not easy. Let's see what's going to happen in the summer. But, yeah, look, I'm happy. I would... I would prefer to play a player from La Masia and play Marcos Alonso. I've, like I said, I've never been a huge fan of, um, of him. And also, like I said, in the first season, he had his moments. He played quite a lot of games in La Liga. I think he played over like 20 games in his first season in La Liga, which was good. Yeah, he does seems to get quite a lot of injuries as well. But I think it's time to clean the house. And yeah, I, I thought I'd just give him... Um, my quickly thoughts on, on this and I want to hear of course from you guys and remember for more Barca news I want you guys to smash the like and also subscribe to the channel but yeah look it's not a player I'm gonna say I hate it it's not a player I'm gonna say that I love it so I mean like I said I'm not a huge fan of him but I'm happy that he's living we need to clean the house we've got a lot of talent coming from La Masia and I expect even with Barca financial situation that which you know is poor to sign a few players next summer that was the reason why we signed him two seasons ago at least you know he won he won the Isla League as well he he, like I said, he had his moments and Xavi trusts him. And um, yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, you know, he can say, Look, I played for Barca and I won La Liga with Barcelona. And um, yeah, he's 33 years old. So, I mean, he's still got a few more years. Let's see uh, what is going to be next for him. But yeah, um, that's all from me on this video. God bless you all, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Plenty of videos coming up. This is why I keep uh, telling you guys, make sure to subscribe, because in here, it's not fake stuff. It's all fact, fact, and fact, my people. God bless you all.